Hey there everyone, welcome back. So today I was checking out my news feed and it said that over a hundred thousand dollars worth of RAM and noodles were actually stolen. And I actually believe I know who actually stole the noodles. But let's check out this uh, news article quickly about it before I actually reveal who stole the hundred thousand dollars worth of RAM and noodles. I'm coming to us from Georgia. Authorities in Georgia say one hundred thousand dollars worth of ramen noodles were stolen from outside of a Fayetteville gas station. Now clearly this was some kind of parcel that was delivered and then was taken. Now police are investigating this as a string of thefts in the area. And you know what, Natasha, I've done the math. And if there's two servings per package of ramen noodles, noodles at a dollar a piece that would have lasted myself and my college roommates for 36 years wow 36 years of ramen yeah. noodles that, that's something to think about that, that salt and taste <laughs> probably a little much oh yeah that would be uh yeah <laughs> devastating all right well this all right so that was the news article basically stating that there was a truck that was left outside of a gas station with the package of ramen noodles and instead of the gas station i guess bringing it inside somebody else decided to come over and steal the trailer full of $100,000 worth of ramen noodles. And like the news reporter said, those ramen noodles would have lasted her and her roommate 36 years. Jeez, I couldn't even imagine having that much ramen noodle. All right, so it's time to reveal who actually stole the $100,000 worth of ramen noodles. That's right, I found out who it was. Check this out. <laughs> That's right everyone, it's the ramen king, the ramen god himself, Garrett Ginner, who actually stole that trailer of $100,000 of ramen noodles just so he could survive and live off of it for the next 36 years if not plus. <laughs> if you guys didn't realize by now, this video is nothing but a joke. Uh, I just saw the video of the news uh, about basically how there was $100,000 worth of noodles that were stolen and the first person that popped in my mind was Gary Ginner because he's known as the Ramen King or whatever online so I just thought I'd share that and I thought it'd be kind of funny so uh, there you guys go. Plus in Garrett's video he has a thousand packages of ramen noodles and in that trailer of $100,000 uh, they estimated about probably about 210,000 noodle packs, so yeah, there'd be a lot more than just that little chair. <laughs> Unless Garrett's holding out and he has a secret stash of noodles throughout his house. <laughs> I'm just joking, but anyways, if you guys thought this was funny, please like this video, please comment down below, and please subscribe because it helps me out a lot and I really appreciate it.